three Greek men from Macedonia, that area, came to Cincinnati and they started the Cincinnati Chili. First, there was Empress. His name was Karagias. My father came over to this country when he was 16 and he worked for the Empress, Mr. Karagias. They were friends. And then he said, well, I can make this product. I'll go across the river where I won't compete with you. Dixie Chili started in 1929 by my father, Nick Saracatanis. This is the original location. The original store only had seven stools and a place to cook in the back. We were open 24 hours. I mean, people would come here at three and four in the morning after Beverly Hills or after any of the theaters downtown or, you know, it was a big place to come to eat after entertainment. People like Groucho was here, uh, Jack Benny. These people came into the store to eat. What makes the chili special is, of course, the spices that go into it. In Greece, they make uh, many dishes called either moussaka or pastizo, but many of the dishes have cinnamon, nutmeg, those sweet uh, spices that are Mideastern. When Mr. Karagiev at the Empress had chili, he added those spices to the chili, and that's when it became popular. And at that time, they put it on hot dogs, Coney Islands. There was no cheese. And as I understand it, the story that I got is that he took some chili home to somebody that was helping him at the house, and that person put it on spaghetti. And that's when the three-way started. Um, just chili is a two-way. Then on top of that, if you put cheese, it's a three-way. And then if you add onions, that's a four-way. Or you could add beans, and that's a four-way also. But if you add beans and onions, that's a five-way. And we have a six-way, which is fresh chopped garlic. I really am thinking about health when I'm thinking about the menu because almost all of our stuff is low-fat. Um, and I make my own salad dressings. I make really good Greek dressing with extra virgin olive oil. And my ranch dressing's made with real buttermilk and people do come for the salads. And then I have uh, my mother's recipe of vegetarian vegetable soup that we sell a lot of. Now we have gyros. We've only had gyros about a year. So they're getting very popular. Of course, the three-way and the cheese coney are the most popular. We sell about, I would say, 600 to 800 cheese conies a day. A lot of people like this system because it's very quick and they like watching their food being made. You know, and if, if they put too much mustard on or they don't want any mustard or you know something happens, they can actually see it. I have customers, more than one that's over 100 years old. Uh, they've been coming here for forever. That's the fun part of it. I see babies turn to mature men and women. That's really a lot of fun.